Well, I drove into Lightning to get to church. And <clears throat> I got there. <clears throat> I stumbled in. I think I stepped on the wrong foot. I lit a candle. And I went inside and I saw there were only like, I mean, beside the priest, like about three people. And one of them was the lady who was getting crispated. <clears throat> And her sponsor, or steward, or I don't remember what the word is for it. And then um, there's another, there's a gentleman who sings with us, and um, oh, my friend Donna. So then while I was sitting there, I realized I forgot to venerate. So I went back out, and there was this thick, huge, beautiful, tall, just fragrant with roses um, wreath on top of the icon, which I had never even seen that one before, and it was really gorgeous. And then I went back in. <laughs> and there was a lot of shuffling and moving of things around. And they had taken the side table out towards the front, and there was like candles on it and something else and something else and something else. I don't know. And then back in the corner where they had taken that from um, was what I remembered that they had used um, for the baptism when I saw the one on the baby. And it really does look like a like an oversized wine glass. It's really funny. It's copper or something. So eventually everything was all set up. And um, he had, uh, but the priest had like told us what was going to happen. And then he walked with Donna and my friend, Donna, my friend, and the ladies doing first meeting toward the back of the church. And then um, they were going through all sorts of. Um,